Yo, 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 this is Service the Bear, and we are doing a little, just a little video of me playing Between the Stars. I am currently in the prologue right now, and not that far, to be honest. And that basically picked up from where I am just now. It's not going to be a massive long video. So, yeah, we're going to get started. Captain, we're being hailed. Shall we accept the call? Affirmative. Ex Pleo, commander of the Starship Insurrection of the Pirate Fleet here. I order your immediate retreat. This frigate is now under our control. Surrender, or we'll open fire. This is the captain of the warship Genesis of the Interstellar Republic. I demand you halt your activities immediately. Captain Scott? Of the warship Genesis? In that hunk of chunk? <laughs> you asked for it. Crew to arm! The whole system I've currently got right now set up is uh, I tried to set light control to the mouth.
Captain, the ship's remains correspond to the freighter we've been searching for. We have to look for survivors, and confirm the shipment was in fact stolen. Preparing to board. Enter what's left of the freighter as the bay doors close behind you. Within it, you find the remains of what used to be an enormous commercial freighter. You can see all sorts of supplies and objects on the floor, accompanied by what were once their crew. After some time searching the corridors, some of the passageways with two possibilities. Oh, so you come across a passageway with two possibilities. Yeah. <laughs> Left or right? Yeah, go right. Uh, your crew and you advance through the corridor you've chosen. The further into the ship you go, the more you feel you're not alone. After a while, you reach another cross crossway. Let's go left. You reach a small chamber where the path splits off into two directions again. One of the specialists says, Captain, I think we've been here already. You look a bit closer and you're almost sure you're back on the first turn you made. Okay. Uh, the crew and I have advanced through the corridor you've chosen. Further into the ship. Yeah, some more alone again. Let's go right. Oh god, again. Right. Well at the start, so we go right. We go right. Okay. <laughs> After walking in circles, you arrive at a hallway and a bay door opens in front of you. Through the door frame, you're still within dark the darkness and are able to make out a faint light. Let's go! As soon as you enter the bay doors close and lights turn on, at the end of the room you see raw protonite shipments stacked in rows and rings of light. A robotic voice surprises you. It seems to be the ship's Maya. System intruders detected in the loading bay, activating security protocol. Op opening it. Blah. Oh god. Um. Halt! We are the crew of the Genesis of the Republic. The eye waits a few seconds before it can. Opening suspended. Validating credentials. Error. They are intruders. Okay. Uh, the AI system hesitates for a few seconds, establishing analysis. Probability of intruders not being identified as intruders are 100%. <laughs> you hear the server motors of the evacuation door screech. Zero percent probability that intruders identify as intruders. Establishing analysis error. The AI begins to calculate probabilities while it seems confused. Only someone who isn't an intruder would claim they are.
If the intruder claims it is an intruder, probability profile incompatible. As it exchanged different errors, you hear the voice shut down due to a logic error, it goes closed, and you're not with me. Remind me never to upset our mind. <laughs> you load the chest of the float knight onto the ship, and you look for the registry of what could have happened. The engineers search through the few working terminals left, but all data appears to be corrupt. You make a security copy to be what? You make a security copy to be able to study it later. Okay. Let's go back to the station to inform Susan. What kind of pirates assault a protonite freighter just to abandon it? X player's weapons do not correspond to the radiation we've been following. Captain, the coded data seems to follow the same pattern obtained in the slaver's base. Our team can't undertake an investigation. We haven't found enough matches. Well, this is certainly got interesting. Ship requesting docking permission, please. Station control tower here. Dock at the assigned bay. Over. Receiving coordinates. Establishing communication. Docking protocol prepared. Yeah, we already get to know our dock before that happens, so <laughs> that might be a thing it needs to be. Just tweet. Yeah, my docking could definitely be better. <laughs> Don't Don complete. Only, Only authorized personnel to disembark. disembark. Alright, let's have a look to see what's the buy. That's if I want to make any of those in there. I'm gonna scrap. If I've got anything to scrap. I'll, I'll leave that. Cause that should still. It looks like it's still kicking in my I need to go to the docks. Up with Susan. After arriving at the station, you go to the docking port where your ship is located. In it, you spot Susan, who rushes out to meet you. You're back. Have you found anything? 
Susan looks at you. Expect it. Are you waiting for your answer? Mm. They were violently butchered. There we go. Susan looks at looks shocked by the news. After a few seconds, she recovers and begins to speak. That can't be. I've known their pilot since we were kids. You were able to recover the cargo? Yes. We were able to recover the cargo. Please note I am Scott the man. The woman with the manly voice. <laughs> Well, at least there are some good news. The crew is currently working heavily on the repairs. Since you need the ship as soon as possible, maybe your engineers could help us. Uh, could you process the proton light slabs? Can fabricate a new iron reactor? Of course! Okay. Ah, uh, you've obtained the first blueprint! And uh, with the specified amount of materials, you will create the object within the department sector of your inventory. In this section, you will be able to... You will be able to find different areas of your ship that your crew members can also work on. The engineering workshop allows you to create objects via the blueprints and required materials. The salvage allows you to destroy weapons and systems to obtain resources. Sick Bay is a zero. As is only designed to help no wait, to heal your crew members for five points and diseases. The uh, investigation center allows you to study different objects uh, to progress in events obtain cures to different viruses, obtain blueprints, and let you procure better weapons than those of standard quality. Press your I button. The little I. To access the inventory, go to the department screen in the inventory and scrap the raw. Prop night. With the obtained materials, fabricate an iron reactor. Okay. Alright. Inventory, the buttons. Scrappy, scrappy. Clicky. Put you there. Ding! Ba -ba -ba -ba. Now we need to go a bit here. Iron reactor! Ta-da! We are done. Susan examines the iron reactor closely. An excellent job. With this, we'll have everything we need to finish the repairs. I have another favor for you to ask. You while we finish things up. Speak to me when you are ready to go. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm pretty much like me for one minute, but hey-ho. Crew member sides. Tasks. Ooh. Oh, that's the contract. contract. Isn't that the bits before you go? Inspection, we stopped receiving Fortnite shipments after the attack. Ugh. Bear with me. 
There we go. Why no go duck? Oh, we should accept the mission. Ah. Alright. Go. Well, we have a long way to go. We should depart. Engines on maximum drive. Unauthorized order. You lack bridge privileges. So now I have a babysitter? Is the Republic sending you to watch over me? It's a matter of security, Mr. Huggins. The last Protonite shipment was assaulted. Captains are not what they used to be. If a pirate ship attacked me, there wouldn't be enough space for them to hide. We're sure of that. Hmm. I think he seems a bit confident, don't you think? I think he needs to slap her on the head. Can't we just toss him to the mining station and slob it off there? Oh, I don't think that would be good. This is kind of like hyper space movie classic. What the hell? These transport ships are not ours. It seems they found a more interesting intermediary than your company, Mr. Huggins. This can't be. We have to register this immediately. I'm messing about with the explosion. Still you. Focus on. I have no. Whoa. <laughs> Adjust the range. Don't know what the range does. Oh. Okay. Near radius. I have no idea where that does. I just wait around trying to see if I can see anything. Done. No idea. Far radius. No idea. I shall take a picture. Yep. Okay. Have we done what needs to be done? I have no idea. When the foreman finds out, heads will roll. Well, that's great. We're going to the second grade. Okay. Ooh. Oh, pardon me. Captain, we have to go back to the station now. What happened? I forgot my lunch. Mr. Huggins. False alarm, I found it. I'm like, no, you're staying here. You can starve. Captain, there's no sign of activity on the station. It looks completely abandoned. We should dock and discover what's going on here. I'll stay on this ship. Uh, co covering your backs. No, you're coming with us. I don't trust you with my ship. Texting offline is 
authorized personnel to disembark. Alrighty, we're on. Let's go here. While the dock bay doors open and the captain and her crew arrive into a large reception room. It is currently only only has emergency lights on that show the remains of a broken furniture strewn around the floor, forming a large mountains of rubble. I would say we definitely need to reactivate the generators. We got look for survivors and let's continue our advance. I go with that. You search a chamber for an emergency general to rebuild the systems. After a few minutes, you find a room that contains generators. Natalia Olov, head of the engineer team. Captain, we detected an anomaly in the generators. We could only use the remains of one of the destroyed machines to make them work again. level doesn't allow you to succeed. <laughs> With great skill, you begin to mount your amalgamation of different pieces that you find within the rubble. And you place an artifact in the affected generator area and pull the lever. Boom! The artifact explodes, you disappear, or dis disappearing shrapnel towards you. Or dispensing. Sorry, nothing else. Oh, God. I actually quite like these die things. I have not dealt with these in ages. <laughs> Your crew upgrade to level allows you to succeed. Team analysis of damage and the minute care and pairs. Temporary solution. A few minutes later, the construction of the pads allows the energy to flow temporarily. With the lights on, you can see the construction chamber and the dust cloud that develops the area. Among the remains of rubble, you can see a human burial remains. And then you continue through the chamber, you suddenly hear one of the bodies still breathing. Yes, I'd say we help him. Uh, upon digging out the body, you find one crewman still alive, badly wounded man. They came. We resisted. The man moves his arm slowly and pulls out the ID card and he hands it to you. Uh, light fades from his eyes. Oh. Okay, rest. We need to find out what happened here. Uh, you advance to the hallways on the walls you can see scratch marks blood you reach a completely sealed bay door next to it you can see a small key card team can you try and hack the terminal System upgrade level allows you to succeed. The engineering team gets to work and starts manipulating the terminal. A few minutes later, you hear the electronic sound and the bay lights flash a few times before, pardon me, your eyes, the door swings open, allowing your entry. We continue our advance. You advance to the hallway and you search the different rooms that you find. 
You arrive at the bridge, where the log of the recent dockings or events must be. The large computer that occupied the room is completely destroyed. You continue advancing throughout the smaller chambers without any luck, finding anyone nor clues as to what ha could have happened. In one of the rock shops, you find plans for a weapon prototype. Maybe your engineers could make this for you. Let's leave the station. There's nothing left to see. Well, that didn't go down well. So? We've looked over the station. There are no survivors. But... but this can't be happening! We have to inspect the last station. I think I've had enough. We should head back. This oversteps your jurisdiction. Mr. Huggins, you can come with us, or you can stay here. You decide. This is an outrage! You guys are kidnapping me! Preparing the jettison hatch for immediate exit. All right, fine. I'll go with you. I like my Maya. Or Mia. Why did I suddenly stop? Me. I'm not particularly sure if I did that. Probably using her. Yeah. All right. You finally arrive at the last station. After hearing Inspector Huggins' complaints. The entire time, you can't wait to finish the mission. Everything looks calm on the station when you suddenly a group of ships appear in the area. They are pirate ships. You recognize X Below's emblem on their hulls. Maybe they want revenge. There's no time to lose. You order your crews to prepare to defend the station. Everybody, at your posts. Like Captain, crazy. the station is under attack. I told you we should have gone back. We can still turn the ship around. Control yourself, Mr. Huggins. We won't abandon any innocents. Crew, stay alert. We'll hold off the enemy attack. Sir, yes, sir.
after the skirmish. The mining station director thanks you. Thanks, Captain. Those pirates appeared out of nowhere. They wanted to keep our Britonite extraction. We're lucky you arrived when you did. Are these attacks normal? The director responds in a nervous tone. No. They are unusually very peaceful. But at the past few days, there have been a few skirmishes between the pirates and the trade ships. But this exceeds any instant we've had to date. Do you have any information that could be deemed useful? You ask the director if he has any information that could be shed some light on the pirate's intentions. He responds, I have no idea what they could have want besides our protonite. Although, an attack on this scale, it just isn't logical. Oh, wait a moment. The director disappears from the visor, only to return some short time later. I've been informed that we've recovered an encrypted transmission on one of the ships. Maybe we'll help you. Thank you, Chief. Captain, the corrupt transmission corresponds to the rest of the data patterns. Is it possible to begin an investigation, Crewman Burton? The science team currently believes we have enough data to decode everything. We will begin right away. Understood. Alrighty. So, I am going to call it there. As houseworks are now happening in the house. As you can hear by the hoovering sounds. So, that's just a little playthrough for the game so far just now. Uh, I might do some later on videos depending how I am, but so far I'm liking the game. It is still in early access at one time. It is on Steam for sale. And you can also get it from Games Planet as well. And a few other places. Uh, that's it for now, and I will catch you later. Bye-bye.